You know, some parts of our area are seeing some light rain today, but pretty much everyone is hoping for a little bit more, right? And the people at the top of that list are farmers. WAT6 on your side reporter Elizabeth Kubel in studio right now after visiting a few local farms. And Elizabeth, the showers we've seen, are they making any impact? Well, Bo, a Maryville farmer told me, not really, at least not on the current crop. It's coming a little too late for that. But of course, the rain is welcome moving forward. Some moisture in the ground will really help out when they plant their winter crop. These are fairy tales right here. Albert Conning shows off some of his most recent harvest. They're going to have a, a, a yellow spot on them. That's that sunshine on that. The crops impacted by the recent spell of dry and hot weather. Best jack o patch I ever had since I've been growing jack o uh, that We had it this year, but we only harvest about half of them. Some scattered showers in Monday's forecast won't help Conning's current batch of pumpkins. He's already picked those, he says. But wet weather is welcome as he gears up for winter. If it get the ground wet enough now, more than likely it, it won't get dry enough to really hurt a crop before it get you know, into November, or December maybe. They just help us all around. We got moisture in the ground. We got to have moisture to prepare for next year. A similar story miles away in Lenore City at Deepwell Farm. Their pumpkins turned out a bit smaller this year, but the past weekend's rains will help out the ones that are still growing. And that's what I'm hoping this rain will bring them little ones on because there's still a lot of little ones out there. Both he and Conning Family Farm eager to see even more rain soon. Uh, have it like you really want it. <laughs> that don't happen very often. We'll just take what come that way and uh, deal with it. And something else that the farmers at Conning Family Farm mentioned, Bo, yeah. pumpkins, we all kind of want them, right, getting right. ready for Halloween. Well, they said it is better to go ahead and pick up a pumpkin now. If that is something that you want, you want to do some carving, maybe have sure. it out on your front porch. Because mm -hmm. they said that just because they didn't produce as many this year, maybe as we inch closer to Halloween, we could start to see those pumpkins go up about a dollar. Wow, it's interesting you mentioned that. I was passing a pumpkin patch near my house today, and, like, the pumpkins look great, but there just didn't seem to be as many as I've seen in the past. Which there. makes so, sense. There you go. Yeah. Elizabeth, thank you very much.